Welcome everybody to tutorial number seven. On this tutorial, we're going to build a ladder or add a ladder to our structure right over here. Okay, so let's get started. Uh, first things first, you guys should create, go ahead and go into layer properties window and create a new layer called ladders. Um, set the color to cyan, something easy to see. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do, we're going to hide everything but our grid so let's go ahead and click on under the structure ribbon visibility palette click on the very middle one that says hide others you guys should already know that by now okay so perfect now we just have the grid showing now this is a, a dandy little that I have learned through my working years uh, with uh, AutoCAD plan 3d is if you're putting a ladder there's a there's a very very tiny little thing you can do to make your life a lot easier go ahead and start typing line perfect and snap onto the very midpoint of the the top what would it be top left uh, grid point and draw a little line like so as you can see let's make it 350 millimeters so that will be the distance that um, that your ladder is going to be away from the edge of the structure okay that's pretty much it make sure you're actually on the ladder layer and uh, go ahead click on the ladder button under structure and parts palette first thing we're going to do is click on settings and under the ladder tab as you can see it, there is says type because sometimes in a drawing you'll have several different types of ladders and so you can you can choose different standard ones that you have already made uh, in terms of sizes and dimensions and whatnot under geometry you can see the corresponding um, corresponding dimensions are kind of indicated on this little drawing there and the shapes you can also choose the structural shapes for your actual ladder as you can see uh, we're just gonna keep it as is for now and under the cage tab you can also choose the dimensions of your cage the cage is the fall protection um, cage really uh, it starts about I think a meter not a meter sorry two meter or maybe two and a half meter from the ground so that if you get high enough you don't fall off that easily okay so besides that that's pretty much all we're just gonna keep it as is go ahead and uh, actually press OK and now it's going to ask you to specify the start point so go ahead and um, snap onto the midpoint of of the bottom line there go all the way to the top line so even though it hmm, that's not very correct is it something weird is going on okay let's retry that how about that okay click on ladder now let's choose the midpoint there uh, it's not at the midpoint that's our problem actually the problem was that the line that I drew is not actually on the midpoint so it kind of sucks but you can, you can, you can still kind of snap onto this line it would still build the build the ladder uh, just exactly oh no it actually turned it okay right, so this is the important learning bit so as you can see if it's the directional the very last option that they give you for drawing the ladder it's it, if it is at a angle um, your ladder is going to be also at an angle so let's go ahead and fix that I'm going to just undo a bunch of things okay perfect so what we're going to do is grab the line start typing move choose move snap onto the that's our base point and go to the midpoint it should be okay now so let's click on ladder again S uh, snap onto the bottom midpoint the top and then that perfect now we have a perfect ladder as you can see now it's no longer turned it's actually perpendicular not perpendicular I suppose it's parallel with uh, with your with your uh, face of the structure so let's show everything see everything looks good and that's it it does look good okay that's a short one for today uh, talk to you guys later